Yo, yo, yo. What's up, yo? Uh, rap will survive. Oh, man, crazy. crazy. Trace Carter. Oh, my gosh, man. This dude is... This cat is doing more than making a, de a declaration about an art form. He's actually ministering and leaving yeah. the, the platform of the art called rap. Uh, he's leaving it for God to truly do the work through it. So, oh, man, that was awesome. Yeah. That's a heck of a freshman project right there, bro. And then even, I mean, it's called, he called it a mixtape, but that's like some album type stuff. Oh, my gosh, bro. And uh, I just got the pleasure of being a part of it, Elevationist. We got the pleasure of really knowing this cat for real, for real, helping to develop him, man. We just, we just looking forward to more, yeah. more, uh, more survival music. Yeah, uh, watch, watch him grow, man. Watch the transformation happen. Watch him wrestle with whether he was even going to rap anymore or not, man. And God just totally redeemed his gift. Yeah, and it's power. It's true, Holy Spirit true power. proof that you can uh, you can still spit and, and uh, be as far away from hip hop as possible. Uh, it's still a drug. You don't need it. You don't and need I'm, it. I'm anti hip hop. Hip hop will die. It rap will survive. Yeah, if that's it's in the, Jesus. That's the point. Because if you doing yeah, if you doing anything else, that's gonna die too. Yeah. But rap for Jesus Christ. No ulterior motive. Hip hop dead. Good rap things. alive forever last. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Elevation is signing off code. I'm excited about this new album, Rep Will Survive by Trace Carter. Um, it's such a blessing to see how God can change somebody and completely transform them, a complete 180. Um, this album is just his testimonial. I feel like he's pouring out his heart on this album. He's letting um, listeners know that this is where I used to be and this is where God has brought me this is where he's taking me basically all he's trying to say come wherever you are come to christ give him your heart give him your mind give him all of you because he's waiting and if he can do it for me i know he can do it for you so this this album is crazy that good night joint is crazy it's just it sums it all up you know tuck me in lord good night i'm ready yo what's good it's your boy vision playing i'm um, locking up the church but look yo go out Download that Rap Will Survive, Trace Carter, Trace Carter Music Bandcamp.com. It's fire, man. Like, dude, is a true believer, man. Repping Christ all day. Nothing watered down. Jesus Christ all day, man. You'll love it, man. Have something to bang, something to encourage you, something to convict, something to feed you. Go cop that joint, man. It's a great album. Great. Peace. Amari and Raven. He just got his new mixtape. Love it. It's the bomb. Uh, really, he's really on fire for God, and we really support what he's doing. Um, it's awesome the transformation he's made. We used to know Terrell way like, back when in high school. Mm -hmm. Baby boy was off the chain, off the chain. So to see him living for God and like really like genuine about it and really true and his passion, his fire is amazing and it's awesome. We just. Uh, we're gonna keep him uplifted in prayer and um, hopefully God will continue to bless him, continue to use him the way that he has. And we love it, keep it up, man. We love you. Just recently the other day, I deleted all my music, like my secular, what you wanna call music. And it took everything within me, but and I was trying to justify it, like, well, maybe I could just keep this and delete that and then it could. But at the end of the day, it does not uplift the kingdom or justify God. So I just went on ahead and deleted it in my Chris Brown. And then I've been listening to a CD as well as other like gospel music. Just people representing God. And I think Christian rap as a whole is great. Like people need to hear that. Like I just want to throw his CD at everybody. Like, yeah, you're going to listen. Because <laughs> it's, it's, it's what's up. It's truth, pure. It's just everything. Like... It's from somebody coming from where we used to be, because I mean, we, it's not like we was like this on too, so we are with him 100%. And it's so crazy seeing Terrell with a uh, Christian rap CD, because um, we remember, what, three years ago, Ooh, four years ago, he, he came had, out with a, a CD with uh, his cousin, with his cousin Ann. Ann or whatever, and it was, oh, he'd be like, Streets the Beast. <laughs> It's streets to streets the beats. The beats. But anyway, his, I mean, that CD, his bars and stuff was hot then, too, I mean, but, like, it wasn't for God. I don't know. I was just listening to that old CD and then putting that in and then listening to the new one. It's just, 
God really been working for real and it's awesome. I just want to say it's a movement out here. It is a movement. God is taking 2012 as the year of righteousness. For real. And watch, everybody around us is going to be on fire. For real. It's getting there already. For real, like our generation it's like, getting real. is really standing up. Like the words say, God's about to pour out his spirit upon all flesh. Like everybody, people, random people it's, that you would never think would start living for him to start to. Like us, for instance, everybody who knows we was not on it. But anyways, but now we are and it's great. So turn to Jesus. What's up, people? This is Marlon Scott, and I'm dialing in from the Florida 2. Um, just want to talk a little bit about Terrell Carter. You guys know him as Trace. Uh, this guy has amazed me tremendously to the point where he is a testimony that God is truly real. We're talking about a guy that has not known anything about Christ, then he wasn't raised in church, um, was out there doing everything you can you imagine. He was a secular rapper known in the city of Columbus with the chief execs. He was out here trying to make it. He was out here trying to get paid, get rich, get famous, get his family money, bread, and the Lord came in and changed him. The Lord allowed me to meet him and witness to him to the point where he was already getting dealt with when I met him. I was just another vessel that came and watered the plant and God made the increase. And I want to tell you guys right now, this dude is on fire so hard that all he wants to do is get people saved and preach the gospel through beats to get people saved. It's not about money. It's not about becoming famous. Um, he's been a blessing to me. He's amazed me. I've been in church all my life. And he encourages me more than some people that I've been around that have been saved 50 years. And so I just want to let you guys know to be on the lookout because this guy is, is coming. He's coming, he's bringing wind, he's bringing waves, he's bringing the flood, he's bringing everything. Because if it's not founded on the word of God, which is Jesus Christ, it's coming down. Yo, it's your boy Yard D. And shout out to one of my good friends, Terrell Carter. Man, your growth is simply amazing. Yo, totally explainable for the people that don't know. Um, say in my holy book that the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. But fools despise wisdom and instruction. Yo, all that saying is to real. No fool, man. God fearing man, I love that about you, man. Uh, your music video, hold on to, to good night. Oh, simply amazing. Powerful. Yo, you got my total support, man. Shout out to Christ Movement. All I gotta say is be right or get left. Terrell Carter, who can I say? Um, wonderful man of God, young man who I love dearly, he's my son, he's my son in the gospel, very humble, willing vessel whom God has raised up for this time, for, you know, as the Bible says, for such a time as this, I believe that there is um, an anointing that's going to flow out of this young man, that's going to bless us like never before, I guess you would call him a rap artist, I call him a minstrel, he's not about, um, you know, about promoting himself. He understands all that in terms of record sales and performance, but God has put a burden on his heart for souls, and that's what's very important at this point. I've watched him grow over the past year and, and some months, and it's amazing to see what God has done in this young man's life. I understand that God has sent a flame of fire, a minister, to sweep this city. And um, devil, you better watch out if you're listening. <laughs> because um, he's going to snatch some souls right out of your hand. Shout out to, to Minister Terrell Carter. This is from Pastor Gray. We love you. The HPIF family is right here for you. I want you to know that you definitely have people who has your back. I endorse the man of God. Bless you.